It's January 15th, 2024. Um, for me, it's my one of my son's birthdays. Um, on the calendar, though, big federal holiday. They celebrate on the federal holiday. Um, today, they, they call it Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Um, I'm going to put on the, what is this, Channel 7, the ABC News here. Um, they had, Nassau County had a parade uh, to honor uh, the late uh, person they refer to as Dr. King. Um, it, I mean, for me personally, I look at it, it doesn't look like there's a lot of support. I mean, it's just, it, and I don't know how it got on the calendar. Like if there's a national holiday or a federal holiday, like how does that system work? Again, I mean, I'm still in the one General George Washington on the back of it. It says, in God we trust. Um, I'd like, again, is that a question one would ask? Like the face of Jackson at Independence Hall? Is that a Hamilton, like U.S. Treasury? Like there's some things I just, I don't know where to address it exactly in the system. Um, they honor him. It looks like a leftover from the 60s, but they murdered him. So I don't really know, like, again, how that gets put on a schedule. And then... Who's paying? Who's honoring? I really don't know. It looks like, like, is it a holdover? Is it, like, is there some benefit to having that on the calendar? I don't know. Um, but it's my son's birthday today. Um, I don't really know. But, and it's still on a calendar. He was off from school today. Um, same time. In Manhattan, they don't even, they're not even talking about Martin Luther King. They're uh, having a rally for Palestine um, and this Hamas thing. So um, I don't know if, like, I, I, like, again, I don't know how these movements get started and who opens them. When does it get shut down? Is there, like, a, all right, like, we're supporting this Martin Luther King, but only for so long. Again, they have not pulled the persons. Like I have not gotten any, I'm not, I'm not real clear on any of this. Um, like if you support it, what are you really supporting? I mean, and are there any costs to this support? A whole lot of questions, not a whole lot of people who are are educated enough, I suppose, or intelligent enough, I suppose, in order to answer it. It's really frightening um, because what words of wisdom, I have lots of questions, but not really anybody per se to bounce the questions off of in order to educate my son. Um, and then... And I watched Mean Girls today for the first time ever. The first one, because they're rebooting the movie. Color Purple got rebooted like three times. So I figured it was significant in like, what are they signaling? So the support in Nassau County, it was, it was whatever it was on turnout. Manhattan's got a big population, but nothing to do with Martin Luther King. And then Iowa is coming out real strong, doing something called a caucus, which I had never heard of, but it makes sense. And then I'm listening to the farmers out there or the persons out there. Um, and I'm listening to how they've designed the system. And this one woman speak of, she has some kind of immigrants in something called a Marshall town they placed some persons there and they're not real happy about it because she said people don't want to move in. And I mean, it's 
for sustainability, to keep your numbers up, to keep your population up, to keep your community, your society. It's important. And New York has had some devastating effects post 9-11, whatever that means. I don't really know. Um, I hear the Marines use the 9-11 term. No idea who they are in the five 